Hello, uh, Jim Howard here in Fort Worth, Texas. Today's date, it is December 24th of 2017. It is Christmas Eve. I just received this. This isn't a gift for me. Maybe a gift for somebody else. But it is the mother of all LED flashlights. And I'm not sure what this is. Thank you. And I guess it's just a card. Thank you so much for your purchase. Dee Dee, I can hear you purring like crazy. I don't know if this microphone will pick it up or not. Let's see. Thank you for your purchase. If you have any questions, there is a uh, little instruction book in here, which I have not looked at. Uh, came with a power supply. I hate these that uh, AC plug-in that goes to uh, an adapter like I'd, I'd rather have it be a standard USB micro or something like that but it seems like these things come uh, when you get it I shouldn't have jumped again so fast anyway I unscrewed the back part first because I didn't look I haven't looked at the instructions and you just see they're Uh, circuit board the bottom of the circuit board or whatever so I'm not sure why you'd be able to why you should be able to maybe you could uh, make some repairs or something so you unscrew the top part and you know this is going to be a powerful <laughs> flashlight because it's using four of uh, whoops I thought they were wrapped in, oh, each one of them is. Okay. Uh, I thought it was gonna be one big pack. But these are the uh, 1865 really powerful batteries. Oh, uh, I may have to stop this because I don't want you to, well, see if I can open this, get the cellophane off these batteries here. I have a number of uh, LED flashlights uh, because tactical flashlights. I'm not sure you'd call this a tactical flashlight. This is a, well, it would be a tactical flashlight because I'm sure LED flashlight uh, 10,000 luminas shine this one in somebody's eyes and they're going to be hurting. And uh, like I said, I may have to. So all four of these go in the same way, bottom, bottom first. Oh, they have a little ridge. I see a little ridge there on the thing. There they go. I love these LED flashlights. I, when I worked, well, I spent about 10 years working as a welder, sometimes midnight shift, sometimes second shift. And, and uh, then I uh, worked for the post office a short period of time. I, uh, that was also nights, by the way. But uh, ended up uh, in business for myself a couple times uh, for various things. Eventually ended up working hospital security and I ended up working that um, from 19, my mind has just flipped slipped 30 years hospital security and most of that was working midnight shift or evening shift but at night and of course we didn't have LED flashlights then but we had you know ones that were used nickel cadmium batteries which were a pain uh, in the butt 
So things have improved a lot. But all that time, I went out and uh, purchased really good flashlights for myself. That uh, have working nights or out at night or whatever you're doing at night, having a good flashlight is something you definitely should have. Later on, when I worked, uh, like at one hospital, I, I already, you know, I owned my own heavy duty rechargeable flashlight. Uh, when the director of security saw that, he said, wow. And, uh, I said, I, I told him I needed to buy a new problem with those. You drop them. The, the type of bulb that you had in there, you drop them or you bang them, and uh, bulb broke right away. And the bulbs were expensive. The flashlights were expensive. Anyway, I told the director of security, well, I got to go buy, I forget if it was what something for the, or maybe I was just buying a new flashlight. Because I started out with uh, D cell flashlights, then I went to double uh, A. That was much better. So okay, I've got this. Anyway, I told him I was going to. I showed him the flashlight. I said, I'm going to run over to the law enforcement equipment company and get a new flashlight or whatever it was. And he says, "Wow, let me see that." I showed it to him, and. Uh, he said, go over there and buy four for the department, you know, four, I think it was four for the department. Now this thing, of course, it's, this is aluminum. DD, you want to see there, you want to see here like that? This is aluminum. It feels really, really strong. Um, you know, it plugs, this charger will plug in there. Like I said, I'm not correct, but that's the way these flashlights, uh, they have these kind of chargers. I mean, if you lose this one, I guess probably any of them would fit. Probably if the jack fits in there, you can use it. Has this seriated, what, you know, you hit somebody with this, they're going to feel it. Of course, uh, when I was working security, I had, you know, the long flashlights, uh, all stainless steel, and the, some of them that I used, over, I lost, like I lost, like one time I bought a shorter, smaller one that I could carry in my, on my belt all the time, and that may be the one that I went over to buy, one for a small one for myself, and uh, instead I, of course, ended up getting for the department, but yeah, that, I think that was, I helped somebody out of, and a patient came into the hospital and needed to be carried out of the vehicle. And uh, then the family or friends left, and my brand new uh, flashlight had fallen in their car or whatever. I never got it back. But for that type of work, I prefer the long, because if you... Uh, need to j hit somebody, you know, and jab them in the stomach with the, the end. Uh, they had a, like a bulb. It varied with the flashlight. It had a thing on the end that was good for striking. Um, or if you actually had to hit somebody, not in the head, hopefully, but break the clavicle or whatever. Or, But uh, this is, this is different. I mean, you could hit somebody with that and you could, but... Uh, Oh, man, I just hit the switch. That, if that switch came on, easy. Oh, man, this is bright. I don't know if I'll... That's dim. That's off. Super bright. Dimmer. And off. I think there's... Probably there's an SOS thing if you hold it or something. Yeah. Well, it's not actually SOS. It's just strobing. If you were out and you ran into uh, trouble, I like that because some of these lights, DD knows this, don't you, DD? Yeah, some of these lights that you have, like I have a smaller one over there, 
She's giving me love bites. Ouch, ouch, be gentle. Okay, be gentle. I don't think she, ouch, be gentle. Hey, you're getting, starting to get rough. I don't think she likes me doing this YouTube video. Wants me to pay attention to her. Yeah, I like this, uh, these other lights you'll have. So say you're out, you're walking and somebody's coming up to you or something is, you know, and some of them, you hit the switch and you might get the strobe, the SOS one, you know, dash, 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 dot, 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 dash, dash, dash. And that may be not what you, you know, that may be not what you want. And that could get you hurt. You no, know, what you want is when you hit the switch, it's bright. And then if you want to, you know, I could see if you were out someplace and you, this just got us out of focus, didn't it? Uh, so I like the way this is designed. This is heavy. That's uh, fat. But what I like about it is the, uh, well, the light, super bright light. That's shine that in somebody, disorient them, and, you know, run like hell. Or if you have to strike back at them or something, you know. My recommendation is just run. I never ran because I always had to, didn't have the option of running. You know, I had a job to do. But, um, I like the fact that you don't have, because like the other flashlight that's over there, I give these things away usually as gifts, and everybody that I give one to, it just loves it. Um, I think I'll hang on to this one. I, of course, it is Christmas Eve. And, uh, but, uh, yeah, what I like about this is the fact that when you press it, you're going to get the bright light. You don't want to, you got to have a situation, somebody has you cornered, somebody has something, they're coming for you or whatever. You don't want to hit it and have it uh, come on. Some of the, some of these lights have like four or five different things that they, you know, super dim, a uh, little brighter, medium light, bright light, flash, 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 flash. And depending on when you, what last one you use, but you don't want to be out. You want to be out, when you hit it, you want to know you got something in their face. And, uh, D.D., you are so needy for affection. Which end are you at? Here you are. Okay, you are in a bad mood. Not normal for you. Comes with these, uh, the batteries. And, uh, okay, you're coming down. Okay, you're going to come down that way. Okay, bye-bye. It comes with these batteries, and you can purchase these batteries. I've actually, because a bunch of these things, see, not just these flashlights. What are some other things that I have got that came with these? First time these, uh, something came with these batteries, these 16850 or whatever it is. Um... 18650, I got it right. First time I thought, man, man, these AA batteries, they look large. They really look large, you know. And then, and then I thought, whoa. Uh, then I started seeing that, you know, that a lot of products were coming and that the bulb or that the batteries are uh, available. I don't, I've got it lashed down, I think, over there. I even purchased a, uh, battery charger for these type of batteries and you can do that so super bright let's see 500 meter distance maximum output uh, comes to 10,000 lumina features three adaptable high low and strobe and like I said I like the way that's arranged tough and durable aircraft grade aluminum anodized, anti-abrasive coating, skid proof, etc. I definitely like this product and I will give it five stars. 
uh, some of these other flashlights. I'm sort of I, I love LED lights. I love aluminum. Uh, I love flashlights. And usually, what happens is I have one of these around, and a, re a maintenance guy or repair guy or somebody will, you know, come and he, he doesn't have a light or something, and I'll say, "Oh well, here you can have this." So I'm going to try to hang on to this. I like this, but I do have. I only have about two pair of pants, and really one pair of pants that fits me and this one's got a hole here in the thing where I fell out in the street stepping off a curb getting terrible to get old but uh, this has these pair this pants has uh, well I can I can slide down here and show you one of them uh, I have a flashlight like these and I had several but and it will slip right down you know into a these are kind of cargo pants or what would you, tactical pants or something. And this one, <laughs> this one is, if you have a pants pocket, it'll fit in, but it'll probably pull my, pull my pants down. But I do like it. I do recommend it. Uh, like I said, I've, I've always been interested in solar cells, metal. I used to be a welder. I'm interested in, you know, my first welding job, actually, I was overqualified for it because I was, I had actually gone to, uh, you know, welding school, Lincoln Electric Company in Cleveland, Ohio to, to uh, but then the first job I got was a wrought iron decorative iron shop and we did anodizing and uh, only worked there a few months and then moved on to a better, you know, paying job and we used my talents as, as a welder, but. I love aluminum and uh, stainless steel. I don't think I have anything that was that's titanium, but uh, if I if they made them and if I had the money, I I probably buy everything that's titanium. Anyway, I knew this was going to be a winner when I ordered it, and I try to hang on to it. I have a fault. I am a r river to my people. Thank you very much for watching.